Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I have a quick video for you. I am in my kitchen. I'm going to be doing a vignette on my tray that I have on my island. This is my first stage of decorating in the kitchen. So this is the tray that I'm doing and I know you can probably see a few Christmas items over there. I guess I'm just getting started at the kitchen. This is the first thing that I want to work on. Now I put my little Mrs. Claus Baked With Love tea towel on the tray first. I thought this would look really cute because I am doing a little bit of a baking and candy theme plus a little bit of whimsy in here. Next I have this container here that I'm going to be making an arrangement in. The first thing I want to do is just put a little bit of greenery in here and I have this here. This is a tree topper that I made many years ago and it's just made up of a few different large picks. Sticking that in first and then I have this other little pick here. Actually it's a big pick. Looks, looks a little bit like peppermint so we're going to put that in and I have some of these really small greenery picks that I got from Hobby Lobby many many years ago. I'm going to tuck those in too. Now here is a few pieces from a garland that I cut up. I actually have used this on my railing before, that's why I cut them into pieces. I'm going to tuck those in. I also have these cute little picks too that I'm going to tuck in. And I just want to put this one pick of the peppermint candy. And I'm needing just a little bit more greenery, so I'm going to add a few more picks here and there. Okay, now I am going to go ahead and put these in here. Even though it's silver, I think it ties in with the silver on the handle. And I want to put a few more of these in. So here is how it's looking so far. I know it looks a little bare on that right side because I'm going to be adding, yes, an elf. <laughs> I want to put a few of my elves in here and I thought he'd look really cute hanging off of that side. That's why I left that side a little bare. Now the next thing I'm going to do is be adding this little pedestal that I made. This is just a candlestick that I had this top to a wood box. This is a wood piece and I just glued it on and painted it that way. Now here is a candy jar, or actually it's a cookie jar that I got from Home Goods last year. I'm just going to set that on top of there. Okay, and the next thing I've done is just add a little bit of greenery in the tray, and I love this pick because I kind of have the dark green and the lime green. I think it's going to look perfect on top of the greenery. A few more pieces here, some ornament clusters that I made, and of course with that piece of the garland. And then I just want to tuck in these two uh, plastic ornaments that I have. Now this is the cookie jar that I got from Goodwill that I showed. I actually changed out the lids on each. I thought it looked cuter this way, switching out the lids. And this candle here I got from my friend Lucy here on YouTube. She sent me this. And I like how it says Elf Village and of course it has the peppermint scent so it's perfect for in here. I just have it sitting next here to the cookie jar and I'm just tucking in another one of those small greenery picks and this berry pick. Now I'm thinking about using this little peppermint candy ornament there or maybe this little pick. I don't know. Let's see. I'm not sure what I like the best here. Oh, maybe we'll just leave it alone. Let's go ahead and start on this side here. Again, I'm going to be using one of these little greenery picks and a ornament cluster I made and another berry pick. Just want to have a little bit of something here on the right side. And I decided to use this piece here. Another little piece from a garland. I think I like this much better than the having the peppermint swirls in there since I already have it. A lot of red. I think this will do much better. 
can get it to stay in there where I want it. <laughs> Gotta play with this a little bit. Get it just right. Okay, I'm liking that. Mm -hmm. All right, so now I have an idea for that ornament, the peppermint ornament. I think I'm gonna take this and I am gonna wrap it around the hand of the elf and have him holding it. I think that will look really cute. Yes, that is perfect. Definitely needed a little touch having him hold something. The next thing I'm doing is taking some of these little glitter balls again, and I am just going to be throwing them in and filling up the empty spaces of the tray. Just going to be pouring them in, spreading them around. Whoops. The thing with the chicken wire thing is they do fall out every once in a while, so to kind of make sure they stay in. Okay. Now, let's look at a few close-up pictures. I really love how this turned out. This is the direction that I'm going in the kitchen. A little bit of cooking, a little bit of candy theme, and a little bit of whimsy. I hope that you enjoyed the video today, and if you did, I appreciate a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, I would just love for you to hit that subscribe button down below and make sure you hit the bell to get all the notifications of my new videos coming up. I want to wish everybody a very wonderful weekend, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.